Welcome to another video. So today we will be discussing about the patterns of speciation. So there are two major patterns that we have to study. Let us go through one by one. So first up is anagenesis. Now what is anagenesis? In anagenesis, the original species is transformed into a different species altogether over many generations. For example, look at this right, this bird right here. It is an ancestor of this bird. So this has been derived from this original species and it has been over many generations. Ana means new and genos meaning race. It is a very rare phenomena that you observe and it is also called as the phylactic evolution. One thing is that this would entirely be replaced by the new species. So one taxon is replaced by the other. So you can just estimate that this mechanism actually decreases the diversity because one species replaces the other species. Next pattern is cladogenesis. The pattern of branching of the ancestral species so the ancestor species branches out to give two or more new species. So if you look here, this is the ancestor. It has branched out to give two different species. Now the word cladose means branch. So we have seen that the ancestor has branched. Here it is very common to observe cladogenesis and I can give you the best known example that is adaptive radiation. We had seen that Darwin's finches had been patterned up, had been branched into different 14 different types of finches. It's called the branching evolution and it increases the diversity. Why? Because the number of species are increased after this. So this is about cladogenesis. I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, please subscribe to my channel so that I can post more and more videos. Bye.